All right, the challenge is in front of you. Do you accept it? I hope so. Keep the game on. Play the challenge. It's solo challenge, Madden Ultimate Team. And the offense readies for a first down and 10. Now they'll run it on the toss. And he'll work this one up to no about chance, the 38. No Give him nine on the carry that time, and they're set up Nowhere, with a second and one. Nowhere. Even though they gave up more than they wanted to on that play, it actually illustrates how well they bottled him up throughout the game because that was his longest run of this contest. Right, right, right. No, 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 no. Check. Patriot! Patriot! Hurry up, hurry up. And they'll try the ground game here with the running back. Check 50, check 50. Eight yards on the pickup there, and it moves the sticks. We don't talk about it very often, but sometimes there's a dip in intensity when you start the second half, which can manifest itself in some sloppy tackling. And how about right there? He ran right through that weak tackle attempt. And they'll go ground game here with a tailback. And he'll fight his way forward to about the 48-yard line. Sheldon Richardson there to make the play. They tried a quick hitter inside, but that one was swallowed up because what they're hoping, those big defensive linemen will take the bait and move laterally and open up a crease that they can run through. Didn't happen on that play. Now they'll run it on the toss. And he's got it across the midfield stripe and into Viking territory. It'll be a gain of five, but still about three yards shy of the first down marker, and now it's third down. He was hoping to get to the edge, but they did a really nice job of forcing him back inside. That's excellent fundamental defensive football. Don't let them outside where they can really shred your defense. Two yards on the pick up there. It's fourth down. I know the scouting report on him is that he doesn't possess the eye discipline to be an elite linebacker, and what that means is his ability to read, react, and make a play. But on that one, he looked like one of those guys. And on the ground they go with a running back. And he's got the first before he's brought down at the 39-yard line. Well, we kind of looked at each other as they decided to go for it. But in the end, great execution, a six-yard gain, and it all works out. All runs on this drive so far. It's first and 10. And they'll go on the ground. And he'll take it down to the 30-yard line. Nine yards is the pick up there, and they'll have a second and one. So two minutes to go in a wild first half. We'll come back here right after this. A reminder coming up here at halftime. We'll ship you off to Orlando. Jonathan Coachman will have first half highlights and analysis from a back and forth first half that we've seen. And he'll be a little shy of the 25 here at the 26-yard line. Only three there on the pickup, but that's enough to move the chains. Lucky 56. Lucky 56. Throwing now. Elway on first down. They'll tussle for it, and this is going to be caught. A good gain of 14 there, and it moves the chains. First down now, but that clock rolling. And they'll run it here. A nice run there, nine yards, and it'll be second down. Some good strong running right there, some power and some explosiveness just about got him into the end zone. Detroit! Detroit! On second down, Elway. And this is caught. He's got it. Touchdown, L.A. And that does it for this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. You did it. You defeated it. Congratulations. We'll see you next
All right, so the challenge is laid out in front of you. Can you complete it? We're about to find out. Solo challenge, Madden Ultimate Team time. Let's go. And now the offense getting set, first and ten. Now they'll run it on the toss. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. Give him 12 yards on that one. It earns him a fresh set of downs. Relatively small sample size, but that's his longest run of the first quarter. Bounced it out to the outside to make it successful. And to get there, you actually need some help. It's not just your pure speed getting to the corner, making sure that the blocking is taken care of inside so the pursuit doesn't get you. And oftentimes, those wide receivers, tight ends that might be flexed out, they've got to control the edge and make sure no one from the outside can spill the play before he gets there. Whenever we talk about the best strong safeties, one word constantly comes up, and that's instincts. Being able to diagnose runner pass and make the appropriate moves. He crashed down hard there. He was ready for that running play. Jalen Smith, the Notre Dame man, in on the tackle. Well, if you're a football guy, that's a pretty run because everyone is in sync right there. Obviously, the guy carrying the ball, but how about the people up front? Leverage, athleticism, they create some nice space for him. And taking it across midfield and inside the 45. They give him 13 yards there on the play and a fresh set of downs. Well, they're making an effort to get the ground game going tonight. So far, it's working. I like what we're seeing from the offensive line. They seem to have the leverage going and they're controlling things and reestablishing the line of scrimmage, moving that defensive front backwards. But also like what the runner's given us, too. It appears that he's been waiting all day long to get out here and take off. He's had success on this drive, but not on this play. Finally, they bowed up defensively. I think they were determined not to let him take it pretty much all the way down the field. Yeah, it looks like they handled their run responsibilities correctly this time. When we call them run fits, everyone was in the right place. It's a gain of six, moves him to a manageable third and two situation. A quick burst there, and he nicely bit off a pretty decent gain. And Tucker's kick right there. It's good. And that does it for this one. Pat yourself on the back. You just completed and dominated the Madden Ultimate Team Solo Challenge. All right, it's Madden Ultimate Team's solo challenge. You know the drill. Let's get right down to it. So first and 10 of the Rams offense gets ready. They'll look to throw. Now a desperation throw deep. And he's going to take this one in for a Rams touchdown. 
All right, nice job. I believe that is challenge met and defeated from where I sit. Congratulations. Good job on this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. All right, you saw the challenge on the screen. I don't need to repeat it. It's solo challenge. Madden Ultimate Team, go earn your keep. The Packers offense here, ready to go on first and 10. They'll start the drive with a carry by Jones. And he will forge his way forward only up to the two-yard line. Credit him with a one-yard gain there to make it second and nine. Well, he got what he could there, just trying to move forward and, and gain a little bit of yardage and create some space. You know the pressure is going to be tough defensively. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. The Packers on third down. They're hitting at just 30%, three for 10. This is third and 10. Two minutes remain here in the first half. Back with more after this. The Packers on third down. They're hitting at just 30%, three for 10. This is third and 10. Rodgers with a give, it's Aaron Jones. Oh, and he's not gonna make it out of the end zone. The push too strong, and that'll be a safety. Nice job, congratulations, defeating the Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. All right, your challenge awaits. Can you fulfill that solo challenge? Time to find out. It is indeed the solo challenge, and it's Madden Ultimate Team time.
And the offense readies for a first down and 10. And they'll go with a ground attack here. So a nice job to break the one tackle, but not much daylight after that as he's brought down. Big Sheldon Rankin's there to bring him down. What's the old expression? Three yards in a cloud of dust? In this case, it's dust-covered pellets. It's no longer that old grass that we used to play on right and chew it up. Now we've got that artificial surface. You see the pellets go up. Still a nice play by the defense. And they'll work this down to the 40-yard line. Tackled there. They give him 10 yards on that one, and that'll earn him a fresh set of downs. Boy, he does it at a high level, doesn't he? Because when I watch him, I think of his vision. Straight ahead, peripheral, also has that sense of where holes are going to be before they actually open. I think that helps set him apart from many of the other backs in the league. Give him nine on the carry that time, and they're set up with a second and one. They've had some success here in overtime on this opening drive running the football right back to that well. And why not? When you have that kind of success, make them stop you. And until they do, keep going back to that well you just spoke about. I think there's more water there and available to them. So that does it. Put this one in the books. A successful Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. See you next time. All right, the challenge is in front of you. Do you accept it? I hope so. Keep the game on. Play the challenge. It's solo challenge, Madden Ultimate Team. And now the offense getting set first and 10. Go! Now a play fake here on first down. He's going to loft one deep left side here. And nearly picked off. Surprising to see a defender of his caliber let it get away. But it does get away and it's second down. Detroit! Detroit! Oh, man, that was close. The opportunity to change momentum. Big play right in his hands. Unable to come down with it. A sigh of relief, no doubt, on offense that that fell harmlessly to the ground. That's caught inside the 20. A big play there for L.A. 72 yards. Well, partner, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flipped field position there? A nice attacking play. They picked up a heck of a chunk of yardage. Throwing again, it's Elway, and it's complete. He's got it in the end zone, touchdown Rams. And that does it for this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. You did it, you defeated it, congratulations. We'll see you next time.
All right, so the challenge is laid out in front of you. Can you complete it? We're about to find out. Solo challenge, Madden Ultimate Team time. Let's go. The Patriot offense set to go as they've got it first and ten. And they'll try the ground game here with the running back. Oh, and now he bowls him over. And he gets it inside the 35 and just shy of the 30. 14 yards is the pickup there and a New England first down. And he continues to pile up the yardage. That puts him over a buck 50 now. And this defense has really had its problems trying to keep him contained. Running game working. They'll stick with it on first down. And now running right through him. And he doesn't quite make it, taking it with it, an eyelash. Dropped at the one. A big run there, 29 yards and a first. Now that was a big run. It takes them all the way down to the one-yard line, and that'll shake the confidence of any defense. So when they're looking for a little bit of support now, looking at their defensive coordinator, if I'm him, I dial up some pressure. I just go after them because otherwise, you're still playing back on your heels, and that's not going to help your defense at all. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he is in for the score. And it is absolute stun silence here as they win it on the road in overtime. And that does. All right, it's Madden Ultimate Team Solo Challenge. You know the drill. Let's get right down to it. And the offense readies for a first down and 10. On first down, Elway going up top. It got his man complete. And he is finally out of bounds, but not before taking it down inside the 30. It's a big play there for the Patriots. 46 yards. And I don't quite know what's happening here. It's a first down, but the field goal team is out onto the field. This to break our fourth quarter tie. And Tucker's kick right there. It's good. All right, nice job. I believe that is challenge met and defeated from where I sit. Congratulations. Good job on this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge.
All right, you saw the challenge on the screen. I don't need to repeat it. It's solo challenge. Madden Ultimate Team, go earn your keep. And now the offense getting set, first and ten. Double tight, guys, double tight. Even, even, four down, even. Set, three, 19. Now they'll run it on the toss. Oh, able to avoid him. It's a foot race. He's at the 30. He cuts right side and all the way in. Touchdown, New England. Nice job. Congratulations. Defeating the Madden Ultimate Team Solo Challenge. All right, your challenge awaits. Can you fulfill that solo challenge? Time to find out. It is indeed the solo challenge, and it's Madden Ultimate Team time. And the Chiefs offense ready to go on first down and 10. Watch left. Tight, tight. Watch left. Here we go. Green, 90. Green, 90. Ware takes the give from Mahomes. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. It's a loss of a yard there and now second down. An interesting and intriguing decision there defensively because they kept extra DBs on the field despite seeing the multiple tight end look that came out for the offense. I thought they were going to switch out of it. I didn't know if they felt Mahomes hit. He lost the football. And the Patriots have it. So that does it. Put this one in the books. A successful Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. See you next time.
And now the offense will look to convert on third down. Now they'll run it on the toss. Call it no gain there, and it leads to a fourth down. As usual, the hallmark of a good run defense, linebackers making plays near the line of scrimmage. Absolutely nowhere to run there. Got to try it here. He's back to throw. Sliding out of the pocket. They had to go for it with such little time remaining. Well, unfortunately, unable to achieve the result. And the offense gets set here for a third down play. Three down, three down. Now they'll run it on the toss. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. That goes as a gain of 11 and a Patriot first down. I definitely like the play call. You don't expect it on third and five, third and six, do you? You expect a pass play. Had a little courage there to call the run, and boy, they were successful. Right back to him on first down. And able to push his way forward here for a good little game. It's a six-yard pickup, but it gets him to second and four. And when you get good yardage like that on first down, it really does a whole lot of good for your entire offense. But I love the way he's finishing those runs. At the end of things, he's making sure he gets just a little bit extra. And he'll be brought down this time at the five-yard line. Seven yards on the pickup there, and now they've got it first and goal. Now the offense going to use the first of their timeouts. They'll give it to him right up the gut. And he is in. Touchdown, New England. And that does it for this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. You did it. You defeated it. Congratulations. We'll see you next time. All right, the challenge is in front of you. Do you accept it? I hope so. Keep the game on. Play the challenge. It's Solo Challenge, Madden Ultimate Team. So it's first and 10 for the Bears on offense as they get ready to go. Hey, 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 guys, guys, check me out. Check Stop. me out. 180! Back to throw. Over the middle, and it's incomplete. Trey Burton, the one he was looking for. And that'll bring up second down. Sometimes the coverage is so good, no matter what you're doing on offense, you just can't shake anyone free. They try their best to find someone open, but they took away every passing alley, every angle, and shut the play down. And that one drops to the ground, incomplete. Clock stops here, just inside of 20 seconds, 19 left. Big play coming up. Here's third and ten. I would expect to see some pressure here. There was the pressure you were talking about, forcing the incompletion. And it doesn't always have to end in a sack, does it? Sometimes you can make a good play by forcing the incompletion with the pressure. And Robinson with a big catch. Come on, come on. 
And he'll be corralled well upfield right around the 40-yard line. It's a gain of 20 and picking up the first. And he'll stop the clock with five seconds to go there on the spike. And it's incomplete, and now just three seconds left. Look at the clock. Time for one more shot. 180! One last shot for Trubisky. And, oh, a crusher there as it's intercepted. Picked off by Harrison Smith. There he goes right side. And he takes this one back into the end zone. And the Patriot defense has a touchdown. And that does it for this one. Pat yourself on the back. You just completed and dominated the Madden Ultimate. All right, so the challenge is laid out in front of you. Can you complete it? We're about to find out. Solo challenge, Madden Ultimate Team time. Let's go. And now the offense getting ready on gun, second gun. down. Gun, gun! Now let's go! Green, 39! Green, 39! Detroit! Detroit! They fake the give. Now Elway. He's going to float this one deep right side. And this is caught. Touchdown, Patriots. All right, nice job. I believe that is challenge met and defeated from where I sit. Congratulations. Good job on this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. The Texans offense ready for first and ten. Single, single. Check four, check four. Red, green, the down. He's back to throw. Throwing right side, that's complete. Demarius Thomas. He's at the 40, 20, 
10. And yes, he's into the end zone. So they get the late score they needed. And now the extra point can tie this thing up in the final minute. Nice job. Congratulations. Defeating the Madden Ultimate Team. Solo check. And the offense readies for a first down and 10. Strong left. Strong left. Strong left. Down. From the end zone, Watson. And his throw here is incomplete. The pro bowler, DeAndre Hopkins, the intended receiver. And it's second down. All right, that one fell incomplete there, but the best quarterbacks, they'll miss on 40% of their throws somewhere in that neighborhood, similar to a great hitter in baseball who's going to fail seven out of 10 times and still have a great year. In this case, you want perfection, but way better that it hits the ground instead of going to an opposite color jersey. Another throw on second down, and this one incomplete as well. Hey, blue lady, blue lady. From his end zone, Watson on third and long. And he's got the completion to Hopkins. And he gets this up just shy of the 15. And now they come up and spike it to stop the clock. Single, single, slot, slot. Hey, you're on an island over there. You're on an island. Down! Green, the line! Green, the line! Watson looks to throw again. Pressure gets to him, and down he goes. Back at the four-yard line. Ryan Shazier coming hard on the blitz. He dumps him for a loss of eight. And now the clock will stop as he's able to get up and spike it here. And the trick play doesn't work. Good reaction there defensively, and it'll be fourth down. Green the line! Green the line! On fourth down, Watson going deep for Hopkins. And it's knocked away and incomplete. So that does it. Put this one in the books. A successful Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. See you next time. All right, it's Madden Ultimate Team Solo Challenge. You know the drill. Let's get right down to it. The Patriot offense set to go as they've got it first and 10. They go play action here on first down. Looking deep for Hilton. Oh, incomplete. A turnover would have really helped there. Almost intercepted. Instead, it's just second down. Three. 
I think he's taking an awful chance with the football right there. You've got a lead. You've got to protect it. And he's taking chances, putting it out there in a little bit of jeopardy. Especially in a spot like this, fourth quarter, as you said, trying to cling to that advantage. Yeah, that one probably should have been picked, huh? He's going to loft one deep left side here. That's caught inside the 20. And he takes this thing way down into Chicago territory. A big play there for New England. 56 yards. No matter the age, John Elway can still throw the deep ball, can he? I think he could be 900 years old and still throw the deep ball. That's one of the best attributes of his game. Had to be hard for him to check it down because he had so much confidence in his arm. And when you make plays like that, you understand why. And he'll go down here at the 12-yard line. Seven yards, the pickup on the pitch and catch. Lucky 56. Lucky 56. Again, it's Elway. And he's got it, and he couldn't quite get there. Tackled down at the one. The Patriot passing game is rolling. They've got another first down. Another nice pick up through the air, and I think a lot of people might expect them to run the ball in this situation, Brandon, but with this lead, they're electing to throw the football. Swings, slants, quick outs, things that they consider safe. Here's Elway. That is going to be caught by Sharp for a New England touchdown. And that does it for this Madden Ultimate Team Solo Challenge. You did it. You defeated it.